Welcome back, you guys! This is Tessindra, continuing my EU4 campaign as Scandinavia. Uh, I believe we had a very, um, kind of pointless war against the HRE. I was hoping to do some, um, HRE busting, but, uh, I don't know how to do it. Turns out, no idea. And, um... The, the Ottomans fired the Reformation War, and I've weakened Europe by a lot. No, you're not getting it. It's mine. And I took East Frisia and Stralsund. They're both... Um, one is an estuary, one is a natural harbor. And then I did take uh, Spain's like Rio Grande over here. So we're going to get another colonial nation in the Rio Grande trade node. So that's fine. We, I would like these two trade nodes as well. We can get a lot of trade. Like, the multiplicative thing by having a lot of trade nodes pass on trade is pretty good. But I think I need to do a little bit of recap on where all my dudes are. Uh, you can get an access. It's fine. So I'm not coring this because that is... I only need to core five of these. We have loans from a lot of people that we're not going to pay back. I did get... Admin tech, what is it? 14? 15? What did, we, what did we get this? Yeah, I've been holding on to this for a while, and I'm not sure what I was going to go for. Because I haven't really been using the Diplo ideas after I annexed Norway and uh, Sweden. So, we could do something with that. Or we could not. We could also not. I could eat up Desmond, but what exactly is my... Governing capacity, we're way over. I think we actually have to go with admin ideas, but I kind of want to go with more military stuff, because like once the golden era is over, we're not going to get that. I'm also thinking like if we go with quality, because we got a bonus because we annexed Sweden. We got their combat thing, didn't we? So if I go to military... Yeah. Swedish Corleans and Swedish Steel. Is that a permanent thing or not? Mm. That is going to expire in five years, but that's a 10% modifier. I think the 20% is... Yeah, so that 20 is permanent, but we can get another 10 here as a discipline. Cavalry combat ability. I mean... What do I get for quality here? Yearly prestige and prestige decay. Income from vassals. Ooh. Uh, no. Yeah, I don't know. I honestly don't know. I've been knowing what ideas to go for is always an issue for me. Like, I, I, I knew I wanted to get Diplo ideas. Sorry, influence. Um, because of all the vassals. I don't need them anymore, but we could easily do something with that. You guys returned... Oh yeah, you did! You were in Spain, and I told you to walk home. Interesting. Oh, you are actually a cannon short. Um, oh, right, I've got some dudes over here. That's Perm. Legitimacy is not as high as I would like. There's a great project we could do. San Antonio Mission. Missionaries plus one. Do I want to invest into this? Sure. It's going to get built eventually. And I, I, I mean, I could start building a lot of buildings, but my income is fine. I see no reason to min-max that at all. Uh, the, while everything is going on here in Europe, my aggressive expansion is at 32 here, kind of close. Actually, wait, where is my aggressive expansion? It would be Diplo, wouldn't it? Coalition. So France is very upset with us. So is England. But everybody else is like uh, 20, 30-ish. We could go further east. Mascara or oh, to the Ottomans. Oh no! What about Persia? Najran and Hormuz. 
We could. could feed this to Perm, even though it's not their idea group. Not their uh, culture group. Muscovy, we could wipe them out. Yeah, let's just do that. That's fine. Could probably take out the Great Horde? Yeah, that's... Oh, these guys are allied together. How big are you? Bashkira. Uh, BA, Bashkira. Development, 17. So even if I don't call belligerent them, I could go, with war, go to war with the Great Horde and just eat them up. And then we don't have to deal with the Ottomans. Nope, we're not paying back. Screw you guys. Um, you guys have your cannon. So I'm going to move you east. And let's just mop up this area here. I still want to cock block the Ottomans here. Uh, yes, attrition is fine ish. Colonies. Are we good on colonies? I think we are. We could just keep going colonizing everything here, but I kind of want to start wiping out, because we've got, like, New Spain. <sighs> like, do I want to conquer all of these dudes or not? I kind of do, but I d they're just all allied together, aren't they? Like, we have claims on all of this. Should use it, right? Let me see here. If I go into the mission tree, let's just go to speed 2. Let things coast a bit while we do that. Let's also go to war with you. Yes. So, what are we missing? The cities of the Hansa. Yeah, that's not going to happen anytime soon. Conquer Estonia. Expand the sound toll. That's going to have to wait. Uh, everything else is done except for conquer England. So, England and sort of the Hansa control the channel. Okay. Uh, Educated people. We need to have 15 universities. Picardy. Sure. Gold Coast. I mean, we could just take that from somebody. There's a lot of different people here. The Gold Coast is a trade zone, isn't it? No. Oh, it's anything over here. Okay. Could I get a claim on this? So if I do... Where is my colonist? I don't have one. I got my colonist through events, didn't I? Are we going to have to go, like, exploration ideas? So expand, like, I would like, do we need explorers or conquistadors? I don't think we do. A merchant. This one is kind of interesting. Makes the centers of trade cheaper. It's the relations. Uh, influence ideas. Tariffs and income from vassals. Def morale of armies. No, more navies. Defensive ideas. Don't care about that. Do we go expansion ideas? I think we do. Fuck it. Let's go. Let's go. And once we have one, like, foot in the door, we can take the rest of this stuff over there. Uh, what else are we doing? I just sort of sent my dudes here and I didn't really pay attention to what's happening. Go to Buskira. Take that out. Uh, let's see here. That is the Gold Coast. Protector of Catholicism. I think we kind of failed this. No, no, no. We have to just ally them. Oh, and then this is the one we're gonna, probably going to fail. Yeah, our alliance with the Pope got borked. Hey, Stralsund. Nice. So... There you go. Thank you. The German mercenaries. We're going to have to conquer more into the HRE for that. 
Three countries with at least 200 development. We could get that, but it's just power projection. I'm over 50, which is all I really care about. And this is all connected. It's all connected. Push further west. In Louisiana. Okay. Oh, thank you. Uh, invest in the workforce? Four agendas from burgers. I, I don't get agendas. I'm going to have to turn that off to get this. Subjugate Prussia. Pomeranian? Okay. Are we going to have to turn that off? Isn't that really, really good? We have a... Um... So. Royal favoritism. That is over here, isn't it? No. Where is it? That's one. We could change this, but what is it going to cost us? It is giving us... Reduces the loyalty loss from seizing crownlands. Can we just do that now? No, we need to be at peace. Our crownlands are fine. Uh, regional councils... Has access to age unique state edicts. Age of absolutism, negative 10 year separatism. Ooh. Interesting. State maintenance. That's just money. Dipper relations, vassal force limit. Interesting. All estates influence reform. I don't think we want reform. <sighs> I don't know. I don't think we're going to have this one. Regional councils. So it makes the state maintenance cheaper. What are we paying for state maintenance? State maintenance, 9.52 ducats. It's barely a thing. But we also get age unique state edicts. Is it one of these? Um, does it just add? It probably adds to the state possible edicts then. It's gonna cost me 50 here. Centralizing a state will refund 50% of its cost. Centralized monarchical monarch monarchical Autonomy change cooldown all estates loyal to equilibrium monthly autonomy chain Um I mean honestly yes this is useless I don't even have access to this because I don't have exploration no, no, maybe. Like, the fact that this is 10 years of separatism and I have humanist ideas, but separatists are not an issue. Let's go with you. And then we could actually do a diet and then go for the burgers. Lund, have a shipyard. Very, very easy to do. Shipyard in Lund. Okay, so once we do that, we're gonna get that mission completed. Sorry, that took a while, but it's fine. Ooh, wait. So we are 
Let's see, do we get the points or not? We're at 566. <gasps> okay, we got the points. That's that's fine. Absolutely fine. Why are both of you moving, you dipshits? Absolute morons. So with this, we can eat up these three and give them to Perm. It probably won't cost us much. Just go ahead. What do you have? You've got the... You've got a two-siege, dude. That's fine. Alright, let's speed things up. Speed four. I don't know what's going to happen over here, but I think the Ottomans are going to beat the crap out of these dudes. Could we go to war with the Ottomans after this? Because they're going to run out of manpower, aren't they? Let's see here. They are allied with... The Timurids. Can I... If I do this and declare war... The Ottomans have a massive amount of debt. But they are pretty big, so they can probably go even further into debt, right? What do they have? Admin, influence, quantity, and initiative. Quantity does not give you anything for combat. Except for, you know, the manpower. Okay. Hey, we got the Great Horde. Good. We can mop this up. We can get a free merchant. Okay, where do we want this guy? Um, we've got one in Jamaica. And I kind of want to stop this to, from flowing down here. Because we got competition over there. Most of the gold is flowing out. Actually, wait. It says it's got six, it's got 12 gold here. Six, so there's still 12 gold in there. But I have nothing in Ohio, do I? Let's put him here, because we're going to have a colonial nation there. Alright, speed forward. Let's wrap this up. Okay, so we got Bashkira. Let's help you siege this. Can we eat up Bashkira? Almost. Great Horde. Can we just eat them up like this? No, we can't. Because we can't see the other provinces. Okay. 71%. Uh, just stay there. The Pope is very unhappy with us. What did I do to the Pope again? That's Tuscany. I violate... I'm violating your treaty, but... Honestly, fuck you for giving that to the other dudes. Who did he give that treaty to? Was it was it it was France, wasn't it? I took a bunch of stuff from France. Muscovy. Full annexation. Uh yes. Okay. Scandinavian whatever. Just wipe them out. Bashkira wants peace, but honestly, I want both of this. Embezzler! Oh, it's our heir. Okay. We got Embezzler on our heir. Not what I wanted, but okay. So this is the Great Horde. That was the Bashkira army, I think. No. You still have your army? 7k. Where is it? Am I blind? We can't see his army. Fine. Just let him hide somewhere? How do you have access to the Commonwealth? Honestly, guys, we're just mopping up some things here. No need to be dramatic. How is this war going, by the way? Plus eight. But it is the deciding war. Even if everything here flips to Protestant, I'm still going to be Catholic. Okay, so. 
Do we separate piece? I kind of... We have to, right? We kind of have to, because I can't take this thing unless we hold it. So this is... Uh, expand the thing there. That was one... Four agendas from burgers completed. So it doesn't tell me how many I've done. Does it count the ones I did before? Did I do any before? I don't remember. Anyway, we can go after Persia after this. We just got some discovery spread. Okay, pause. Mm, this should flip next month. Advisor cost. Let's piss off these dudes, it's fine. Okay. Scandinavian Mexico, yes. And then all of these things transfer over. Okay. What, they didn't? All right, we did have, we still have these things we took from Muscovy. Okay, so we've got another colonial nation. And trade should go up here by quite a bit, I think. Oh, you have to core all of that. But maybe. One. Okay, whatever. Some more of it's getting pulled out. And I immediately got another merchant. I mean, we gotta put him here, right? Okay. Um... Hmm. I'm gonna have to f just go into this province here. It's hiding. Or maybe I just have to wipe out this army. It should be pretty quick. No! All of the random loans we got, I am not paying you back. So, Bashkira? Just go in there. I'll cut you in half. Reduce the attrition by a little bit, but I still have 69,000, giggity, um, manpower. And we have a cap of 100,000. So we're good. So this should wipe out this area mostly. I want to wipe out Persia, and then we can just go east as much as we want. And get a whole bunch of vassals. I want the military points. Okay, so that's done. Let's uh, take all your money and your provinces, and same deal with you. Uh huh. Okay. Great Horde is no more. Say goodbye to the Great Horde. I'm just putting them out of their misery, really. So, Perm. You have a debt? I'll pay that off. Grant Province. That one. That one. That one. Oh, god damn it. It's like, I clicked on something on the map that was not just a province. It was like, I don't know, a building or something. And then it closes the window for me. Kara? Yes. Sarotov. That one. Okay. And then grant you that one. And that one. Wonderful. Core that for me. You do have a claim on Persia. Can we just dive right into this war? Do you have claims on anything up there? No, you don't. Okay. So, not, Hormuz is all the way down here. I can actually see it on the map. And Najran, I don't even know. Uh, it's fine. Let's see what we find down here. Access to undiscovered lands. Oh, I forgot this is separate. Why did they put, like, similar colors right next to each other? Why? I thought this was the same weird long-ass trade node. I'm almost capped on prestige. It's fine. 
So where is the Persian capital? Down there? Yes. There's a bunch of forts probably on the way. Go down to here. They have an army of 60k. Military tech 13. That seems low. Religious trait offensive ideas and defensive. Okay, so they might be strong, but I think their tech is... Yeah, they're two techs behind us. Oh, no. So... I think, ideally, we just take some land so we can push further into others. And just sort of snowball a bit. Missionary strength? Sure. We lost a general. Perm is going to help me conquer a lot of stuff here. But I think we might have to swap uh, vassals. Like, we could release Nogai. Nogai? Or we could just give all of this culture to Perm. And then start with, like, the Turkmeni here. Like... Mm, I don't know. We'll see what I can release after this war. So that is a fort that I found. How is the Reformation War going? Uh, I have to like... Hmm. Apparently it's going great. Golestan has been taken. Beautiful. Can I get to the capital? No. We just have to f figure out where I can go. There's apparently an independent dude here. Oh, found someone. He's no longer there. He had no calf? He had 8,000 cannons and no calf. <gasps> he got infantry combat ability? Ooh. I think we still have, for one more year, the 10% extra. So we're at... Hey, this guy's at 40% infantry combat ability. Oh, we can go here. Nice. Oh, no. We're getting converted. Wait. Oh, what's happening? Yeah, got, just, just take military access. It's fine. Oh, no. Uh, if I do... Resistance Reformation, 100%. And you. Wait, this isn't stated? God damn it. Yeah, we'll just freeze this entirely. No, Pope, we're not paying you back. Why is this stuff not stated? It's because I'm over governing capacity and I don't get the pop up anymore. Lovely. If I go into. Was it this button? No. Yes? States. Are you telling me none of this is stated? It's free states, though. We integrated them. God fucking god damn it. What is this? Oh, development. Okay, we can turn that off. Uh, we can turn this off. Oh, yes, I was getting them to development 10. And then I forgot to turn it off, like I said I would. Okay, you, I can turn into a state. And let's see here. Bit, pretty much all of Finland over here. So state maintenance is going to go up. But I think we're going to make more money. Ooh. Let's see, anything else? Yeah. I don't think these states I can turn into. Never mind. What a fuck up. What a colossal fuck up. If we are getting penalties, I'm sure we are. It's fine though. Absolutely fine. So that's a, that's a pretty big stack. Okay, that's good. But my colonist is not free. I don't want to take ahead of time ticks. It's going to be another 12 years until we get another institution. This is Diplo. So, let's take this. This is Adnan. Yes. And 
we could embrace cultures like English and Novgorod. That's probably going to be very, very good. Going to be our Diplo stuff. We could also just promote mercantilism. We're at 26. Let's go up to 30. That's fine. Some simple development there. So if I take your capital, I can begin taking some stuff from you. But I don't see anything over here. Oh wait, there's another nation over here, right? Yeah, this is a different nation. So we don't have to take much. So there's a... this is no guy. None of these are grayed out, so I don't know if I can actually get those. You're gonna take back this fort, that's absolutely fine. Just break down this wall, do this quickly. No, fuck it, we'll just rush in. They got they had 700 people for some reason. It wasn't even a full fort. And Golistan. There we go. Took your capital. I will take back Golistan, I think. They are marching north. Uh, so Hormuz is the straight. I don't remember exactly the layout here, but. Like, this is the rock. This is the gulf. So, it opens up, like, here? I don't remember. It's kind of difficult for me to tell. Kelmar. What? You bastards! You absolute bastards. Lincolnshire? Yes, we'll convert you. So how many dudes did you get back into this fort? Hey, Stralsund. Ah, uh, is that necessary? Where's my, where are my ships? God damn it. I did not do anything with my... After the war there. I completely... No! Lost track. So, we'll just go land here. We'll ditch the horses. Oh! Wait, 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 wait! We are trading in fur! Yearly prestige, 0.5. Cool! And where are the ships? Yeah, we got Stralsund Separatist, that's fine. What is this other one here? East Frisian. Look, go onto the ships, and then land there. And then once you're done with that, we're trading in naval supplies as well! So if I go... was it Ledger? Where was this thing again? It's a trade. Goods. Uh, strategic goods? Trading bonus. <gasps> so! We have naval supplies and fur, so our limit modifier is very, very high. Ming has tea and chinaware, that kind of makes sense. Adal, Adal has a coffee. Yeah, I think Adal starts with like all the coffee. And cloves are in Sunda. I don't even know where that is, but okay, that's fine. We are... yearly prestige is pretty good. Very, very nice. So I kind of want to land, take this back, and then go to East Frisia. It's because there's going to be another rebellion there. You know that. Oh, are you coming for me? No, they're actually leaving. Let's stack wipe his army. Battle of Stralsund. It's fine. And... Mm, let's go here to Shaland. So... Let's have you dock, land up, go here. Why don't you use the ships, you dipshits? Okay, that's fine. Two of them got left behind. We can deal with that. Okay. 
Siege of Golestan. Okay, so we have their capital and a fort. What do we have? Like 45 to work with? And I can't take anything for myself. Yeah, it's too far away. Shit. Hmm. Okay, let's keep that simple then. Take perm. Perm. Oh, it's under siege. God damn it. But I want those things transferred. It's fine. We can leave Samarkand alone. Yeah, it's fine. We don't need to go down here. We can go east. Actual east. But if I take these three, we can block off Persia from this trade node. Shirvan, why are you alive? Oh, because you're a vassal. And let's give this to Perm. So, this all gets transferred. We're fine with that. You have Hormuz and that one. Give me war reps. Okay, it's fine. Don't want anything else. We're good. So, we blocked off the Ottomans from expanding further east, unless they actually go through Persia, which they might. We could annex Perm at some point, but, you know, don't probably don't need to. Is there a good supply limit somewhere here? 38. We can park you guys there. Okay. I thought I was going to be able to push further east, but no, we can't core anything over here. Look at our cash. We can do a bunch of these, apparently. Stonehenge! Lord. Uh, let's see. Dock. Go there. Beautiful. What is this? Money for favors. No, um, sure. Fine. Whatever. I kind of want to dump you guys as... Um, as allies, because this has not really been working out. Okay, so... I can get some allies if I want to. I'm keeping Bohemia, though. Ottomans declares war on the Mamluks. Are they done with this war? Wait! Catholic is the dominant faith! Really? Okay, I mean, interesting. I would not have thought that was going to happen. Pilot, Pilot didn't go away. We are short on allies though, aren't we? We could grab Brittany. They're the wrong religion though. I mean, not ours. Galicia just got freed. Interesting. Songhai could ally them. The Congo. I kind of want to conquer Songhai. Like, Congo would be an interesting ally. Give us access to other places. Yeah, sure, we'll ally Congo. Interesting alliance. Tunisia? Like, could help fight us against Spain? Sure, I'll do that. And what else? How many more allies can I get? Three more. We'll keep... Like, I think I get maybe one more. Timurids. They're allied with the Ottomans, but they will ally me. Sure. And then we'll put... Let's cancel this. I would like to get the Pope back, but he's going to be pissed with me for a while. Yeah. Yeah, I violated the treaty, so he's just... That mission is going to be tough to uh, get. But it's fine. So, subjects, allies, and then we'll just keep one in reserve. East Frisia, we can convert you guys. That should piss them off. Get that rebellion to fire. Where is it? No. Oh, this is subjects. Where's mine? That's East Frisia. 
Provoke, revolt. Oh, I didn't put a leader on him. It's fine. Uh, fort maintenance on border with rival. And we can upgrade our centers of trade very, very cheaply now. Okay. Trier? No, I don't want an alliance with you. So the Ottomans took Bruno. Okay. Another at war with the Mamluks, which are pretty much just dead. They are out of manpower reserves. Interesting! Do I have a claim on the Ottomans? Could we do that? I would be very, very interested in dumping all of our gold on some mercs. And just take the time to properly break the Ottomans. Because they've got to be still in debt, right? So, uh, just to check here. I don't think I can do this. Yeah, they're still in debt with some war exhaustion. Not much. But I don't want them... Ooh, I don't want them. Oh, this is just the trade good. Okay. I don't want them to recover. I would like to take this opportunity to just hurt them. The Temerids would join on their side, though. They do have way more troops than I do, but um, it should be fine. We could even get Military Tech 16. Get the better cannons. Combat with... Oh, look at that. The artillery fire goes up by one. What is it at right now? It goes from 1.4 to 2.4. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um... You guys are here. Go there. You guys split. Don't don't take attrition there. So if I do the same here, split. And yeah. Hmm. War with the Ottomans. Are we up for that? Because Perm is gonna eat most of the attrition. So it's kind of well placed in that regard. Hmm, I don't know if I can actually... I don't know if I have time for a war with the Ottomans. So this is my vassal. He keeps expanding, like he's supposed to. You, you keep expanding. You are still coring. That's fine. War. War with the Ottomans, huh? Are they number one, by the way? Yeah, they are. We're number two. They don't have any vassals, though. Oh, wait, they do have Shervin, but, you know, it's mostly just them. Mm. I've actually never seen this, or gotten this. I might have seen this, but I've never gotten this. Hmm. Let's go to speed four a bit. Let things recover. Galicia. That, no, I don't really want this. Like, what is your alliance? Spain? Portugal, you are just allied with England. Should I just wrap that up, finally? If I call belligerent you, Ah, oh, the amount of profit we could get out of this. We could we could actually just finish off both of these. Well, I don't know if I could eat up Portugal. But I have land here in Porto. Yeah, I can't I can't eat up Portugal. But I could hurt them severely. So if I take a look at Portugal. So the land they have is like all over the place. Yeah. Oh, how I would... Oh, yeah, they have English Columbia. I didn't notice that. Ah, uh, Like, England right now has 101. I could actually just take London and leave them, like, Oxford. I don't know, what is a bigger insult? Just to leave them one of these three? Or just let them leave with these three? And we take London, and then we take... Uh, British Columbia. 
Sorry, English Columbia. Mm, I think we should. I'm not in position to do this right now, but we should. Yeah, we should. We should. Okay, let's do that. Before anybody joins an alliance or anything. So, war goal is just derby. It's fine. And let's go. Let's go to speed 4. Utrecht. Holstein. Holstein is a trade note. Yes, give me this. So, you guys go there. Let's have you go... Scarborough? Those guys should pick you up. Rains brings fertility to Guinea. Oh, yeah, because we have a... We've got a colony here now. Interesting. This this is also England. Oh, this is going to be such a nail in the coffin for them. We're going to have a strong, like, Portuguese border here with Spain. And we could, like, just go straight for his capital, I think. Oh, yeah. There was a fort down here in La Mancha that is just gone now. Uh, no. I don't want to. Uh, where is this? Bahuslen. It's over there. That's fine. Let's wipe them out. Go over there and just eat them up. I'm not that afraid of these guys. Uh, go there. And then go back and here. So you avoid the river crossing. Okay, beautiful. So you guys have landed here. Go ahead and take London. Uh, did your leader actually stay behind? I think he might have. No. You did not take a leader, did you? Damn asses. Oh, six minutes. Oh, why are you so bad? Okay. That's a stack one. But they got a local autonomy thing popped, which is fine. Go away. And go away. Uh, wipe out these rebels for me. Speed 4. Okay. Go to Schleswig. Wipe out these navies. Thank you. Oh wait, this is mine? No, this is Flanders. I had Calais. Thought this was gonna be my rebels. Oh, we don't have enough people here. Uh, this is a massive fort. It's a it's a level 2 fort with a capital fort. So it's a level 5, isn't it? So, 6 to 5 times 3. That's 18,750. So, I'd rather have just a 20k stack here. So, oh, there's a cannon missing? Yeah, there's a cannon missing. Okay, that's probably good. Okay, um, so, go ahead and dock here in Schleswig. <sighs> Let's not piss off the nobles. Not while we're at war. You guys go to Porto. Influenza, we'll pay the admin. Yeah, I'll, usually I will pay the admin for the influenza event. Because it always spreads and just does more damage. Tunisia... There we go. We'll call you in. So they can go after the Portuguese over here. Maybe. Uh, Tunisia. Yeah, this is going to take a while to chew through. Uh, we can do even more great projects. Wonderful. Wonderful. The army has landed. I'm not going to split it up. But I think I don't even have to do anything in the New World. I think we can just take everything just by having London and Lisboa. I think we can. Oh, Congo? Wait, are you... Oh, yeah, you can take the Portuguese stuff. Sure. Let's call them in. <laughs> Let's call them in. Why not? Ooh. Don't have an admiral here. But they only have three heavies. Don't sink my cogs. 
They fled. They did sink. Those are not mine. Are those Tunisia ships? There's no lights in this fleet of mine. Okay, so. I'm gonna get you a leader. It's four combat pips. It's not great, but it's not horrible. Let's just break this. Speed things up. I was planning on taking this tank, maybe, for the Ottomans, but it's fine. I am losing out on the opportunity to hurt the Ottomans, but they are still not recovering rapidly. So it's fine. Wait, could we actually start spying on the Ottomans and then just pay money to get let them get some really, really ridiculous revolts firing? Because that would be pretty cool. That should hurt their manpower in the long term. Make things just generally a bad for them. I'm taking this. Out of time, don't care. Chamber, Deming Cannon, got. Oh no, we're 50 minutes in! Let's finish this war quickly then, I think. Britain is not gonna fight back at all. Okay, take Lisboa. I will give you a blockade. We will break these walls. Ooh, money, 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 money. Let's do this quickly. Actually, I could be carpet sieging. No, 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 no. They might have a, have a high level fort. No, 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 no. That's not a fort. No, no, no. This might for yeah, this is gonna force the ships out, but it's fine. They're just, they're just gonna stay there. Not, they're not gonna engage my ships. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They might sink the Tunisian ships. How do they have ships? They're landlocked. Oh no, 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 they have this. Never mind. Okay, okay. I thought they were I thought they were converting me and I was gonna get upset. Wait, we we got them! We got the three heavies! Very nice. I am playing this on speed four because I'm trying to get a lot of stuff done, so I might be missing some events here. And there. Disease outbreak. Oh, didn't miss that, did I? No. London has fallen. Can you believe it? We're at 60% war score. Oh, this is beautiful! I don't care. So what do I want to take from them? Do I want to grab this as well from Portugal? Because I did co-belligerent them. And we should try to maximize that war score as much as we possibly can. I think we can just land. This is Port this is Tunisia. We can land here or here. I don't need to navally assault anything or Yeah, you guys are not numerous enough to take this. This is a level 4 fort, which is, um, so that's 12,000 units, ideally 13,000. Oh, we're trading in tobacco. Oh, this is foreign spy detection, okay. Wait, where do we get tobacco from? Is that from the New World? It's gotta be. Thank you, thank you. And you are done! Yeah, I'm gonna slow things down a bit. Truce with Spain, yeah. So the war we had with Spain just ended, so they could have allied Portugal now. So I got there just in time. Diplo relations plus one. Thank you. We could take this. It's a very shitty one, though, so I'm not going to. I think I'd rather get mercantilism. I'll take five. There we go. Okay. Is the music cutting out for you guys as well? Or is it just... It's how it's supposed to be. So... Uh, 
Yes, transport me there. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's, let's just do this normally. So, dock up. What is this fleet? Oh, I, I did a split. Never mind. Land and garb? Okay. Ditch uh, most of you. Go there. Take Fez. Once we take Fez, uh, we're pretty much done, I think. Oh no, there's uh, the Yuta. Uh, I can't break the walls. Unfortunately. And then we could just blockade the rest of Portugal, and I think we're good. Portugal is looking at um, 56. England at 72%. We can take so much stuff. The stuff. Think of the stuff. Ottomans declare war in Medina. Uh, ooh. Colonial Cascadia. Yeah, I'm not going to violate that. Sorry, Pope, you don't get to dictate where my colonies are, because they're all over the place. Actually, all of this is mine, according to my map. So, screw you, Pope. Ooh, Florida. S France started another colony next to mine. After I took Florida from them. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, this is taking so long. Oh, it's fine. Did that say ass? What did that say? I missed it. Yeah, they occupied this themselves. Um, that's fine. We can go to war with Portugal again as much as we want. So are you guys friendly towards each other? I think you are. I don't want them to become friends again. I took this colony from them, it seems. Yeah. I took this colony from them. Oh, you guys have been taking this. Wonderful. Very nice. So if I take London, they won't have anywhere to... Um... They, they, will, they will be landlocked. They can't actually colonize if they're landlocked, right? Well, they can, but only in, like, inland stuff. If they were in Africa, they could colonize something that was inland. But now they can't. Sure, I mean, we're getting claims on all of these people. Colonialism being what it is. Mission I can't use my missionary for anything. Sure. 2,500? Sure. Just, just, just sure. Why not? So, Fez, former capital of Morocco, are you going to fall or not? There we go. Thank you. Get to Sayuta. Take Meekness, Meknes. What are we at right now? 62. Did we get there first? Yes, we did. Wonderful. Fuck it, let's just assault it. We got some friendly troops there. And there's nothing else close by to us that's going to threaten us. Even if this does weaken us quite a bit. Look at our manpower. That's fine. It's absolutely fine. I think most of my manpower was here, so that's fine. We can assault again. Also, um, given that my... Um, can I see the great projects that I am constructing? Because I can dump manpower into those, right? Hey, Sayuta fell. Beautiful. So, go back to Porto. Because I would like to dump some manpower into this. Like, this one was Visby City. Domestic trade, yes. So if I do this, that's 10,000. So 70, okay. Beautiful. You have landed in Porto? Where we stand here on the war score? 67 with Portugal? 
and everything that we care about has been, for the most part, occupied. Okay, is there anything good I can get here before I do this? Mercantilism approach. Domestic trade power, merchant trade power, cost to promote mercantilism. Ooh! Curtail the burgers. Trade company. No, no, fuck that. Economic theory. Production efficiency 10%? That's pretty good. Trade power abroad. Sushi spread. Trade. Global trade. This is domestic. Merch trip. I want to do this one. Production efficiency 10%. Like, what am I getting here right now? So, taxation is 49. Production is 40. Trade is 75, though. I think, yeah, we should probably stick to trade, then. Domestic merchant cost to promote mercantilism. This is global trade and trade efficiency, but I'm going to go with this. So, where are we at? We were at 75. Let's see the monthly tick here. 75, ah, uh, not much. Not that much. So, Portugal, buddy old pal. I would like to piece you out and take everything you own in the colonies. All of this will be transferred to my subjects. We'll probably have an issue coring all of this. It's fine. Uh, what do we have left? England, and a whole bunch of people that don't matter. Spain there is a bit of a yikes. Hmm. No, I can't take all of that. Is this enough? I mean, I'm taking the Caribbean. All of it. Let's, let's hurt him some more. Let's take war reps and all his money. Is this good? Spain will join in a coalition, most likely. France probably is well. Spain and France in a coalition against me. It's probably fine. So all of these, none of them went to me, because they all went to my colonies. <laughs> they just the all of the Portuguese investment into the Caribbean just gone. It's just gone. And then I'm gonna take some English stuff as well. Like, I, do, can I take London? Because I think the... So if I take London, the coalition is gonna be... Spain is... <laughs> okay. Uh, I want to stop them colonizing, but honestly, it's fine, I think. So, if I just take, like this I can't take this that's a bit lame hmm oh there's I don't have any for oh they have a fort in the area fascinating well in that case Concede Mexico. Let me see this. I can make them give me that. So concede Mexico. So I can take that even if I don't have the, the fort. And if I do concede Mexico 1. And then I could take everything else. So what do we have here? France and Spain, pretty much. Huh. Uh, give me, give me war reps, money. Hey, would you look at that? So I have to colonize what exactly? Because this is Mexico. Colonial Mexico. 
And Scandinavia, Mexico is there, so this is all passed to them. Oh, except for you, you're Central America. Colonial Colombia, yeah, we never formed you. So let's just take like three development, very, very simple provinces here. That's three, that's four, that's five. And then we can get another nation. <laughs> Why colonize when you can get the AI to do it for you, huh? That's what I like to see. Yeah, you can get money. You deserve it. Cologne? I don't know. No, you don't. You did nothing for me. Okay, so the coalition is kicking off here. So, who joined? Friesland? So, there is a bit of a coalition here. But they're like colonial nations? Ooh, wait, 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 what is this? Let them expand freely. Yes. So we're getting a coalition of the New World. Which is fine, it's like a bunch of nobodies. But Spain and France are not joining in. That is hilarious. Do we have a truce with them? Ugh, can't tell, let me see. No, we don't. France? We don't! Why are they not joining in? Oh man, Portugal, gone. No more. England, multiple times, gone. Florida? Well, technically, uh, France. Oh, look at this, this is Florida right now. They've got enough for a colonial nation. they got five. So we could take more stuff from France. Oh, you know. Alright, let's go ahead and pause it here, shall we? Um, so, the eastern expansion kind of fizzled out because... Um, I didn't take into account that I couldn't call core anything unless I give it to Perm. And I kind of just like Perm this size. I don't want him to get much more. Like, this is this is the trade nodes-ish sort of culture thing that I... This, this land is not worth much. Apart from the gold mine that's, like, here. This stuff isn't worth much. Like, this trade node in its entirety is worth 11 ducats. But it is giving us fur, isn't it? No, the fur is up here. So we have Scandinavian fur all the way from like Norway, nah, Sweden to Perm. And then we got a lot of it over here. Very, very interesting. And the Ottomans are recovering. God damn it. Yeah. Yeah. What can you do, huh? What can you do? I saw an opportunity to just take the colonial stuff for free. Pretty much. And like, we're getting close to all the gold mines over here. So we got this over here. This is ours. And the gold mines are all here. Look at that. Colonial Mexico claimed by Spain. No, 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 no. Mine. It's all mine. Yeah, this is a colonial nation, New Spain, here. Oh, this is the potential for gold. We don't actually know. Yeah. Yeah, these three could be gold. These other ones are definitely gold. Oh, man, we should take all of this. We should take all of this. Actually, do I get... Do I profit if my co colonial nation gets... Gold? Oh, wait, we get treasure fleets, right? We get treasure fleets. Never mind, never mind. Anyway... I will see you guys in the next episode. But until then, see ya. And thanks for watching.